The Inquisition is on everyone's lips. Even the Assembly has taken an interest. I'm told King Balin wished to meet you personally, but the Deshos talked him down. The earthquakes present too great a risk. When the previous king died, Orzammar nearly fell apart. How does one become a shaper of memories? I was born with a keen stone sense. It caught the shaper its attention, but my passion for history earned me the title. It was never really a choice. You seem quite excited by the idea that these titans may exist. My connection to the stone allows me to hear it, but I can only listen. Titans can sing through the stone. It is extraordinary. We call ourselves children of the stone. What does that make the titans? What's life like in Orzammar? I haven't lived in Orzammar for three years, but I receive updates. Is there anything in particular you'd like to know? Do you miss living there? I do sometimes. Particularly the easy access to a warm bath and clean clothes. But the importance of my work outweighs the comforts of the city. A dwarf's caste seems to dictate their entire life in Orzammar. I could bore you for hours about our society's castes and the tensions that go along with them. Simply put, citizens of Orzammar are born into a caste, and that is their lot in life. A member of the Smith caste can never join the warrior caste, and vice versa. Everything is predetermined. There's no way for someone to change castes. It is possible for a member of the lower caste to marry above their station. But only their children's caste will improve. Similarly, when dwarves are made casteless, so are their descendants. A dwarf's caste seems to dictate their entire life in Orzammar. I could bore you for hours about our society's castes and the tensions that go along with them. Simply put, citizens of Orzammar are born into a caste, and that is their lot in life. A member of the Smith caste can never join the warrior caste, and vice versa. Everything is predetermined. How's the political climate in Orzammar? There have been riots due to food shortages, but they will pass, I hope. I've no doubt some Deshers will try to use the situation for their own gain. But the King has a good hold over the Assembly. What are Deshers? Members of the Assembly, all noble-born. Through the Assembly, they govern Orzammar. The King presides over them. A dwarf's caste seems to dictate their entire life in Orzammar. I could bore you for hours about our society's castes and the tensions that go along with them. Simply put, citizens of Orzammar are born into a caste, and that is their lot in life. A member of the Smith caste can never join the warrior caste, and vice versa. Everything is predetermined. There's no way for someone to change castes. It is possible for a member of the lower caste to marry above their station. But only their children's caste will improve. Similarly, when dwarves are made casteless, so are their descendants. A dwarf's caste seems to dictate their entire life in Orzammar. I could bore you for hours about our society's castes and the tensions that go along with them. Simply put, citizens of Orzammar are born into a caste, and that is their lot in life. A member of the Smith caste can never join the warrior caste, and vice versa. Everything is predetermined. There's no way for someone to change castes. It is possible for a member of the lower caste to marry above their station. But only their children's caste will improve. Similarly, when dwarves are made casteless, so are their descendants. That's enough about Orzammar. Of course. Thanks for the insight, Shaper. My pleasure, Inquisitor. We'll speak another time. So it's true. The King involved a servicer. I've been meaning to ask, Inquisitor. Skyhold, how does it... Well, a hold, 
in the sky. How do you keep it from floating away? It's built into a mountain. Ah. Held by the stone, then. I'd like to know more about the Legion of the Dead. The Legion's pretty straightforward. We keep the Darkspawn out of Orzammar, and we're sodding good at it. Becoming a Legionnaire is a lifelong oath, one that can't be broken. We celebrate our own funerals before coming to the Deep Roads. As far as our families in Orzammar are concerned, we're already dead. Hence the name. Well, that's quite the commitment. <laughs> It isn't a glamorous life. Every Legionnaire has their own reasons for joining. From the common criminal to the Deep Lord with illusions of grandeur. All are accepted. What about you? Why did you join? I... had a responsibility. Shaper Volta said you're a veteran of the Blight. <laughs> I was a wet-nosed recruit. But you survived. Swing your axe long enough. You're bound to hit something. You must have racked up a few stories. Hm. Maybe when this is all over, I'll have the time and ale to tell them. Most of Ren's stories end with decapitation. I'm an efficient guy. A historian and a soldier. That's an unlikely friendship. What makes you think we're friends? The bickering. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Vault has got the stones of a silent sister. Doesn't mean I won't give her a hard time. Thanks for your time.